I'm Emil Belvin and I'm a realtor and investor here in the Los Angeles area. And I'm sitting in a property that I just put on the market this week. It's a townhome here in San Pedro. It is three bedrooms, two and a half baths. Uh, we renovated the kitchens and the bathrooms. Um, it has got central AC and heat. It's got a fireplace, cathedral ceilings, and an open floor plan. This property, what's really nice about it, is it's 1,758 square feet. Very nice size for a three bedroom, uh, two and a half bath, with a large master suite, as well as a nice walk-in closet. And we have it listed at the very reasonable price of 589,000. So to tell you a little bit about this particular project, um, it's one of those properties that I actually knew the person, uh, they were losing the property, uh, was found in pretty rough condition. Uh, when I found the property, there was a lot of clutter, there was a lot of uh, deferred maintenance that hadn't been done, um, quite a few things that we needed to do in order to bring the property back to life. Now, when I walk into a home, I don't see anything really that's in there. I don't see, you know, the clutter and the debris, you know, what, all the junk that may be in a room. That, that's not what I'm there for. I'm not there to look at that. What I'm looking for is, you know, the layout, the floor plan, um, you, know, the, the, you know, drywall can be replaced, paint can be changed, carpet can be changed. You know, we refinished the kitchen cabinets, put on new fixtures compared to where they were before. Cabinets are very expensive. So whenever you can keep the kitchen cabinets, the bathroom cabinets, you know, uh, refinish those, paint them, uh, put new knobs on them, bring the cabinets back to life, man, it's a tremendous savings. And then we took the, the old carpet out, that's a given. But there was carpet in the bathroom on this property, so we definitely wanted to get rid of carpet. For me personally, uh, wherever there's gonna be water, I like to do something that's not gonna get damaged. I don't like to do hardwood floors where there's gonna be water. Now today was a big day because today was our first open house. Uh, we did our first open house. This is the moment you've been waiting for, right? You buy the property, you do the renovation, now you wanna put this thing back on the market so that everything kind of pans out the way that you're hoping it will. Uh, we had some good foot traffic, the people came through, uh, we got some good feedback in regard to like, you know, the renovation that had been done, which is good to hear, you know, cause you have your own vision of, you know, how you think it's gonna play out, but it's nice to get people's feedback and like, oh, I really like this and I like what you did with that. So to just kind of talk to you about the numbers, because I know whenever we're talking about flips and renovations, uh, investors especially want to know what the numbers look like. So this property, we were able to acquire the property for $350,000. We were able to acquire it for three fifty, dollars and I have it on the market today for five eighty nine. dollars uh, We put about $25,000 in renovation costs, and that's about half of what we're typically going to spend on a renovation, especially for a single family home. So we're looking to walk away with a decent return for our investment. And again, we purchased it in June. Uh, right now it's December 2nd. And so hopefully we'll be closing right around the first of the year. And that's our goal on this one. If this and other projects are something that you may be interested in, by all means, uh, take my information down and let's talk. My phone number is 310-670-3002. And also you can visit me on the website. I am thevacanthomeguy.com. I'm Emil Belvin. I'm a realtor and investor, and I'll keep you posted on how we shape up on this property.